the start. So I, what was my comment on this module? Uh, this, okay, it is absolutely not an important uh, part of this case, but here you can see these back funnel figures. Granule, granule, line, line, line or granule. So in this cystically degenerated part, uh, you can see uh, also back funnel figures. Now I present uh, the other video in slow motion. So what is this nodule of echogenicity was my question. Hypoechoic. Please? Hypoechoic. It's, it's like a follicular lesion, nodule in a tube. Okay. Uh, I think hypoechoic, it has a dominantly hypoechoic component. I think uh, you naturally has right, because it has almost equal parts of isoechoic and hypoechoic parts. So this is characteristically a heterogeneous nodule. And in my mm. opinion, the isoechoic parts prevail. Mm. I, I thought wrong. No, no, I don't no. I thought hypoechoic was dominant, but I was right. I, think I was that wrong. This is the dominant but but <laughs> we, we can di dispute this uh, and maybe you have right. So I think that this part not uh, surely only in this uh, still image I, once more. So, but this is a, a heterogeneous nodule. We can debate whether the isoechoic or hypoechoic parts prevail. I think these are quite equal. Quite equal. You may, might have right. I um, classified this nodule as a dominantly isohyperechoic, but maybe I was wrong. Uh, if I okay. would not wrong, if I would write, then uh, it, this is my point that except for the ETA pirates, no other uh, uh, pirate systems uh, classifies a dominantly isohyperechoic module uh, as a uh, mm, uh, candidate of uh, as, as a, a high risk module or uh, suspicious module. The ETA uh, emerges from these four guidelines because ETA suggests aspiration cytology in category three lesions if it exceeds 15 millimeters. All other EAC, ACR, and current pirates suggest uh, FNA in this category if the nodule exceeds 20 millimeter. But ETA classifies this type of nodule. Okay, maybe I am not right that this is really this one. But a dominantly isoechoic module is classified among uh, this intermediate category. Only the ET classifies as uh, 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 pirates for lesion pirates. and uh, uh, suggests uh, FNA. Okay, it was a very important point uh, that in great proportion of cases. Uh, uh, it can be debated whether it prevails or this part of the nodule prevails. In different sections, uh, the proportion prevails in one section, the echogenic part, hyperechogenic part, in other section, the hyperechoic part. Uh, okay. Questions, comments related to this case? No?